in this lesson we will learn how to plan and execute test cases in ALM Octane in the same manner like you did in ALM QC. So let's see what you exactly did in ALM QC. Let's log into a project and go here in test plan. So I have here one single test which is not yet in any of the test sets. Yeah, so I can check this in ALM uh, QC by right clicking on it and say go to test in test set. This information, there is no available test set to select from, tells me that this test is not yet planned. Yeah? So there is no run at all. So this is not planned for any execution. Let's check the same in ALM Octane. Let's go to the quality module. And in the quality module, I have the same test and here you can see it uh, either from here in this area that you see there is no run or you can also directly filter here on not run. Not run is not the same like no run in QC. Not run is just, just like telling you that there is zero runs. So there is zero last run. It is not planned yet. So it's the same state currently like you have in QC. Yeah, so let's go to the next step. What would you do in order to plan this test to, for execution in ALM QC? You would, would go to the test lab module, go into a test set, and now you would go here select the correct test and say I would like to execute let's say that just the English one now what you have done you have put and planned the test for execution so this is already your planning what you have done in ALMQC while you have put this into a test set you created an instance which is the planning component of a test in ALMQC, which is also um, flagged with no run. So let's see how to do this in ALM Octane. So in Octane, what I need to do, I can select it. Either I would add it to a test suite, yeah, like the same what we have done, or I can directly say here, plan run. Plan the run for English, it's okay. And now, if I update this, you will see that there is a planned run. And this is exactly the same like you had here with no run in QC. So the planned run in ALM Octane represents the same as you have put a test in a test set in QC. Here you have just said you are planning it to execute. And now let's go and execute this run. Yeah? So we go in QC first and we will now run this. Let's say we run it with manual runner. The manual runner will open now and I can, let's execute, begin run. And now I can say past, 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 and then I stop it. So now I, now I actually executed the planned run in ALM QC. So this test has been planned and I've executed it. Let's do the same in ALM Octane. So I go to Octane. On that test which is planned, I get to go to the run. And on the run I say I want to execute. And now I'm executing the test run and that's it. So in the same manner now I have executed and you can see here this is now a run which happened on the test. So I'm able to exactly represent the same like I did in ALM QC. In Octane it's even easier to do it because you are not tied to a test set in order to execute a manual test. So it's a very easy and simple way to run manual test cases in 
Elam Octane.